So here we are with a uh, another up the pipe production Kenilworth ride uh, with Big Ev. How are you today, Ev? Pretty good, thanks. Yeah. 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 Um, Mother C, you've got yourself uh, some boots there. Tell, tell us a little bit about those boots. Well, well, these are top of the line Alpine stars, but for me, I didn't pay top price for them. Again, no. Gum tree from eBay. <laughs> Uh, size 12. One boot from eBay, you're yep. right. And the other one from Gumtree, size 11. <laughs> so, Ev, I, I see you got your little box there. Oh, yeah, yep. Is that a kit box, is kit, it? My, kit box, yep. That's one of my sponsors. Oh. Performer, um, Performer Plastics, good type. Um, big shout out to them. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Gone back to a standard chain from an O ring chain. Right. Um, Any reason why? Um, it's just what I had in the. Is that off a whipper snipper? It's it's a chainsaw chain, and I, what I do is I go around and I grind all the all the um, all the actual blades off it, and uh, that way it's, I'm all about recycling. Uh, oh, here, here come the popo. Yeah. What, what are you going to be doing with this? Seriously? Hello, Pierre. Go, Pierre go... Pierre's the local police officer here at Kenilworth. Hey, buddy. Wait, are you seriously going to be taking this out in the forest? Are you yeah. kidding? Me? We have standards. This is the bike, mate. Right. <laughs> yeah. Well, very good, mate. All right. We'll see you on the trails. Oh, fuck. That was a big one. Oh, no. Sounds like we've had a flame out. Oh, it's a lovely day here at uh, the forestry trials in Kenilworth. Um, I'm just going to take a bit of a moment here to reflect. Um, it seems to be a constant, um, it's almost an aggression towards the Yamaha, um, given that it's age and, um, you know, it's colour. But what I'm hearing here is the sound of a KDM 690 with a new tyre, mind you, that would somewhat be stuck, I think, down the bottom of this, I'm going to say moderate hill. I'm just at the top of the hill taking in the views. Well, we're not, not quite at the top yet because there's a little way to go. Three quarters away at the hill. Um, been here for about two or three minutes just waiting for this, you know, expensive Austrian pumpkin to get up the hill. I'll just go down and have a look. <coughs> Make sure he's okay. He might need a push. <coughs> Mate. Might need a bit more of a run up, mate. Well, I see you've fucking cleared all the rocks out, Robert. Just chill the shit out of it. <laughs> back.
this one before. A good hill. And lean back on the stem peg, which I don't have. circuits through here. Oop, look, look at land smart, huh? And left, 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 left. angle on that looks about 38 degrees you've hit it at approximately probably about 35 40 kilometers an hour I predict that your area of impact is about here 
Okay, you've then you've then suffered a um, uh, a common a common occurrence known as the pucker factor, um, and uh, dropped the bike off to the left. You've entered a uh, broadside slide, and um, you've uh, find your final rest position is, ladies and gentlemen. The bike was ugly back there. We've had too many crashes today. That was a proper crash. The other stuff was just dropping. That there, she was a crash. I've gone down pretty hard on that one. Brand new KTM. So uh, Ed, we're halfway through the ride now at Imbul yep. um, with uh, Up The Pipe Productions and um, how's the ride going so far? It's going pretty good, thanks. Yeah. Yep. Have you had um, any crashes? Uh, I've had one. I was more of a stall four and uh, more operator error than anything. And uh, no, it still had... counts as a crash though. No, I think I have chipped the front of this. Yeah, I'm just glad if I made it here. Following your nose, is that yep. when you asked me to get the phone out so we could look at the GPS? Yeah. Is that following your nose? Now that, uh, what are you having there for lunch, mate? Really? Can you afford to eat a, a, a what is it, a custard filled donut? No, it's your shout.
probably doesn't look steep, but it's got a bit of gradient on it. ordinary day on the bike today. I've crashed, I've dropped it, I've stalled it, I've stalled it and dropped it. Uh, this is what happens when you don't ride enough. It's like golf. Honey, I need to ride more for my own safety. 